false lambkins was as good a mason as ever laid stone. He built Lord Arnold's castle. Lord Arnold paid him none. He built it without, and he built it within, and he built a false window for himself to get in. Lord Arnold to his lady, I'm a-going from home. And what would you do if false lambkin should come? I fear not false lambkins, nor none of his crew. My doors I keep fastened, my windows pinned to. Her door she had fastened, her windows had pinned. When through the false window, false lambkin stepped in. Dear mistress, dear mistress, your baby does cry. And if you don't come to it, it surely must die. How can I calm down when it's such a dark night and I have not a candle to bear me a light? Take them six new lamps where the gold shines so bright. You can take one of them and come down by the light. Lady Arnold scarce had opened the door when she saw false lambkins in the middle of the floor. False lambkins, false lambkins, oh, spare me my life. And I'll give you my daughter Betsy, she'll make a good wife. Bring down your daughter Betsy, so neat and so trim. And bring a gold basin for to catch her blood in. Daughter Betsy, daughter Betsy, stay in the garret so high till you see your dear father come sailing by. Daughter Betsy, she stayed in the garret so high till she saw Lord Arnold's ships come a-sailing by. Lord Arnold scarce had opened the gate when he saw his dear baby lying dead at his feet. Lord Arnold scarce had opened the door when he saw his dear wife lying dead on the floor. False lampkins shall be hung on a gallows so high, and his false shall be burnt in an oven nearby.